Hello circus fans and grounded aerialists, how are we today? It's a bit gloomy so I thought we'd do some stretching indoors. Lots of us I know are working on our flexibility and trying to maybe get to be able to do the splits. So we're doing lots of stretching and sometimes when we've been stretching for a while we stop seeing any progress and we get a bit stuck. That might be because we're not stretching the right way. So within our legs and our hips and our entire body, we've got nerves as well as muscles. And we have to look after our nerves and get them to be stretchy and flexible in a different way than we do our muscles. Muscles like being stretched from both ends, held gently under tension, not stretching so, so far that it hurts but stretching far enough that you can feel that it's stretching and then breathing and relaxing into it. Nerves do not like that. That makes nerves very angry and they rebel and they get shorter and tighter. So what we have to do with nerves is we have to pull them one end at a time. It's a bit like flossing, like we do with our teeth. OK, so I'm going to show you how to floss the nerves in your legs. First of all, we can work out whether or not the nerves in our legs are actually a bit tight. I know mine are. So when we do our forward fold, lifting up on the seat bones, nice and tall, reaching forward. How far can we get with our toes pointed? And how does it feel? Flex your feet. Go again. Oh, definitely harder. And if it was only my muscles that were tight, it wouldn't be because no muscles go all the way down my legs. Only my nerves do that. So we need to floss our nerves. You're going to come to laying on your back. Pelvis nice and neutral. One leg lifted up, foot on the floor. Keep that leg where it is. The other leg I'm going to hold into my tummy. I'm going to keep it where it is. It doesn't matter if it's here. If that's right for you, that's where you can hold it. That's fine. But your thigh wants to stay where it is. Only the let the lower leg and foot is going to move. So holding it in with my tummy muscles, hip flexors and my quad and just supporting it with my hand. I'm going to point my toe with my leg bent. I'm going to straighten my leg, flex my foot, bend my leg, point my toe. I'm going to do 10 of them. Straighten, flex, bend, point. Straighten, flex, bend, point. I'm going to count on one hand. Straighten, flex, bend, point. can feel it all down the back of your leg. For you that might be a bit different, you might just feel it in your foot, you might just feel it in your calf, you might just feel it behind the back of your knee, you might just feel it right up tight here. Let's see if it's made any difference. Flexed feet, <laughs> yes it has. It's not my muscles that are tight, it's my nerves. Get flossing guys, give it a go, obviously do both sides. Check in with me next week and I'll show you how to do some flossing for your nerves in your shoulders and your arms. Have fun.